Hello, this is Erin, and I am here today to talk to you about my India Immersion 2025. I've been getting such a huge response about this, I think because I've been back and forth to India three times now, and I absolutely love it, and everyone sees my pictures, and I'm glowing and so happy and just having cool experiences. So I've been there enough times, and I know enough people, and I've found enough amazing teachers that... I am leading an immersion there next year. So this immersion is all about the sacred arts of India because learning these arts and experiencing them in your body, they are tools for self-realization. <laughs> and I am a hugely spiritual person. And I'm a spiritual person in the sense of the philosophies and learning and growing and educating. And I'm also spiritual in the sense of being present with my body and experiencing what I am, what is happening in life in real time in my body. Kaya Gatta Vedana Sati. So I have combined these two methods of spirituality into one immersion. So it includes life coaching, which helps you to get tools to where you can process your emotions, communicate in a way that feels good for you to where you feel you get your needs met and you're able to build amazing friendships and be able to resolve conflict and then also get to visit all these cool ass spiritual places. <laughs> so it's the best parts of what I do and my world coming together in one experience. And I think that everyone is excited about that because they kind of see what I can do and they're interested and they want that experience for themselves. Because that is not just how you grow, but it's how you take people with you. That's not just how you go and see cool things in another country, but it's how you make memories that last a lifetime because it's always better when you share it with conscious people. So this retreat and immersion in India is going to take place in Mysore in 2025. It's June 3rd to the 16th, and it is limited to 16 people. And we are going to be staying at a shala that has a hot tub. They cook up three amazing, cleansing, healthy, but yummy meals per day, except for we have breakfast and lunch on Saturdays. Saturday evening, we go explore, and then Sunday, we go explore, and then some of the evenings and midday, we go explore as well. So there's different temples, uh, Sikh temples, where we get to see the amazing generosity of these people who give you food no matter what. They treat you like a brother or a sister, and they invite you in like you're one of them. I had an amazing experience inside of a Jain temple, which is a, it's not necessarily Buddhist, but that is maybe the closest thing I can relate it to, but it's all about radical non-harm <laughs> and the feeling i got from walking into that temple just healed me i call it my spontaneous rapture so there's more work to be done but like it healed a part of me and we're going to be seeing my sword palace which has this amazing light up show on sundays which is amazing for taking pictures but also just the beauty of the experience we're going to be visiting other sacred temples in the area, Chamundi, a Durga temple, and you're going to have amazing teachers that are teaching yoga, pranayama, coaching, Bharat Natyam, which is a sacred dance of India where they use mudras and they kind of move their body in a way that's telling a story, so they're very expressive. Martial arts with my martial arts teacher, Deepak, and he is from Kerala. He's coming all the way up. Uh, which is a sacred art of unlocking and opening up your spine. Combine that with the yoga asana that we're going to be teaching, which is ashtanga, or we have the option for hatha based. So a couple of cool things about this experience is that besides extracurriculars like henna and shopping and Thai massage and so many different things that I'm putting together, it's basically all the things that I love, is that we're able to connect in between sessions with these group activities that I've planned. So again, it's one thing to go on an experience with a group of people and, you know, shallow talking, but you share experience, it's special. It's another thing to have the whole 
experience facilitated by someone who knows how to help people bond and work through their stuff so that they can have lifelong friendships. That is what makes me different. I sincerely care. I'm a born leader. I've been I've owned my studio for 10 years. I've been podcasting for 10 years. I have two books written. So obviously I'm a woman who knows how to get things done. And if you didn't believe me then, I also have a black belt in Shota Kankarati. So <laughs> so if you are looking for someone that cares, that can facilitate an amazing experience, all retreats are not made the same and mine is different. I have the skills, I have the leadership, I have the experience, I have the know-how, I know the people. So it just makes sense. And the price is, you can't beat it. It's $2,500 early bird if you pay in full by October 1st for next year. And your meals are covered, hot tub, accommodation, all excursions that we do on the weekends during the week, there's a small extra fee. And covers your transport to and from the airport. It also covers the life coaching module that we do before we go because if we're spending two weeks together, we want to make sure we have tools, right? I'm going to also teach you little pieces of the language, not too much because I don't know too much Canada, but enough to where when you go there, you know so much about the country already, you've at least tried to speak some of the language so you have that vibration within you and you're already familiar with the people that you're going with. So, I have limited spots. I think by now I only have, uh, if everyone on the waiting list signs up, I have two spots. <laughs> so if you're interested in joining me for this experience, it'll change your life. It is a journey. I'll stand behind that. So come and join us. Uh, you can check out thriveyogafit.com. It, the landing page is up and ready. If you want to register, you can also email me, Aaron at AaronCoach.com. And you can check out my Facebook page. I have a lot of information there as well. Okay. So uh, please reach out to me if you're interested. And I hope that this tickled you in all the right ways. I am doing an India immersion workshop on September 12th if you are a Bradenton, Sarasota local. So you can get a taste of some of the arts, including storytelling, yoga, martial arts, henna, and of course, yummy Indian food. <laughs> I wasn't going to leave that out. All right. I think that's it. Thank you so much and namaste. Thank you so much for listening. If you want to support the podcast and if it's helping you, please consider writing a review. You can go to iTunes or Google Play, go into the search bar and type in Thrive Yoga Fit Transformational Coaching, scroll down and you can leave a review. This helps other people to find me as well as bumps us up in the search ratings. Also, this podcast is sponsor free, so that means we don't receive anything for doing it. If you feel so inclined and this podcast is helping to support you and you want to return the favor and help to support any production costs of the podcast, feel free to give a donation to a Venmo link, Thrive Yoga Fit or PayPal, Aaron at AaronCoach.com. If you don't have the means, don't worry about it. We're not going anywhere. You're all good. But if you would like to give back, you can give back in those ways. Thank you so much. Namaste.